welcome back to Conversations with Nick Kanellakis. As you know, that's me. Most people know that. Uh, anyway, uh, Michael Brown is here as well. Hi, Nick. We have, I think it's safe to say, the most famous violinist in the world on our little program. We just celebrated his 70th birthday. Yeah, I'm delightful to be here. Uh, you're delightful. I'm delightful to be here. Never heard that expression uh, before. It, it, it basically solves two problems. First, that I'm delightful and that, that I like to be here. Instead of, if I'm delighted to be here, yeah. I don't say that I'm delightful. That's I true. just say that I'm delighted. I can be a jerk. I the don't minute you say you're delightful, immediately people will know that you're delightful. Yeah. Because, and then when they mention your name, then they'll say, oh, I heard that he was very delightful. Oh. But they wouldn't remember who said that to them. Well, listen, I just want to say from a personal level. Yeah. Uh, I remember when I was about four years old, I was watching Sesame Street. And you came on, and you were playing the violin. And I, I was watching with my mom. And I turned to my mom, and I said, Mom, can we watch something else? And so we changed the channel to, I think, the Smurfs. I think it was the Smurfs. I liked the Smurfs at that time. I liked the Smurfs a lot. Yeah, the blue, little blue guys. They were great. I like the color blue. Yes. And yeah, I, did you remember the Smurfs? Uh, no, I, I never watched. I was not a Smurf person. But anyway, the point is, I did, for the few seconds that I did watch you play, yeah. I got the, the sound of the violin in my head. And uh, a few days later, uh, I said to my mom, you know, uh, Mom, I would like to play the cello uh, because the violin, I don't know, there was something about it that was a little bright and shrill and just a little... But I thought you said there was a very nice interview. And, uh, and, and, you know, I mean, what, what is this? It's not very oh, nice no, no. to you. No, it's I not mean, very reverent oh, no, to no, you. You know, excuse me, excuse me, I'm, I'm talking. You know, why do I... Can you do something with it? Or? Yeah, uh, I mean, you want me to... Uh, Nick, I think that's I, a little bit rude to... I, mean, I was just telling you about my childhood. No, 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 we are here right. about my childhood. What about my childhood? Well, that's another interview. You know, I, I don't care about your childhood. It's, it's my childhood. This interview, didn't? It, wasn't it about my childhood? Yes, but, but, but I was talking about Sesame Street and my childhood. But this is I, my interview. Okay, okay. Let's, let's talk, talk about, about you. you. Let's, let's talk about interview. you. Let's talk what? about you. Okay, I got, I got some questions. Yes. What do you? What's your favorite thing? What's your? What, what, what's your favorite thing to do in your? I know. I don't know any questions that you haven't been asked before. The thing is this: if 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 somebody asks you an intelligent questions, yeah. as opposed to saying. Uh, where where are you from? Yeah, uh, which happened to me uh, about two or three weeks ago. Uh -huh. Where are you from? And uh, yeah. you know, when did you first start playing the violin? So yeah. I told him to use the Google. Okay. Yeah. Well, anyway, m yeah. uh, moving on. Yeah. I uh, would love to know uh, where you're from, and um, when did you start playing the violin? Can I can I go now? Okay. Look, just to go back to Sesame Street for one yeah, second. Yeah, sure. Okay, so you've ins you inspired a lot of young players to become violinists from that show. Not me, but a lot of a, a lot yes. of uh, young people. Yeah. Do you feel responsible? Do yes. you feel responsible yes. for them? Yes. For the suffering. The responsibility is totally mine. Yeah. The minute you're a string player, you got a lot of stuff to deal with. Yeah. You got to deal with making a, a decent sound. True. After you make a decent sound with the bow, then you got to figure out what, where the hell are you going to put your fingers where so, that, so you that, you, that you play in tune. Yeah. By the time you finish figuring that out, yes. it's 10 years. Oh, okay, ahead. now, pianists. Same. First thing they do, bang, they make a sound. So annoying. So ridiculous, yeah. you know? So after about a month, you can actually play twinkle, twinkle. Yeah, after a month, you know what you can play? Zero, nothing. 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 Yeah. So, well, yeah, what he so said, Michael. What he said. Yes. Why are you getting mad at me? Yeah, because oh, yeah. piano is quite a hard. It's quite hard. <laughs> so you know the piano. The piano parts of those like Strauss notes. There's a lot of notes. Yeah, but so what? So, you know, you know what the, Did you hear tune. that recording? Did you hear the recording? You haven't. But you played on some soundtracks. Yes. Like yes. John Williams and. Yes. Is that sort of what 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 happens when you become a celebrity violinist? That like. At some point, playing the greatest concertos with the greatest orchestras around the world just—it's just, it's just kind of boring after a while, and you got to play like you like you played with Billy Joel, the klezmer stuff, and done all this, that. done that, you know, yeah. I've done it before. I mean, how many times can you play the Brook Concerto with the Berlin Philharmonic? I mean, that's got to be so annoying after a while. Oh, very embarrassing. Very rude. Today, very embarrassing. Isn't it? Rude. So far, you know, it's every other word is an insult. I mean, uh, have I not been nice? I've been, I've, I've been, I think, in my top been, nice you've been, form. You've been incredibly honest. You for have who you insulted are. me at every step of the way, and I've been nice. Eh. What was that kind of? What?
What was that? You know, you're sitting here, you're going like that, you know, he asks the questions, then he looks at the monitor. Yeah. I mean, what is that? Disrespectful. Very. I didn't, I didn't mean to offend you. It's just sort of my nature. It's a, I'm working on it. It's a problem that I have. That I'll believe. Okay. That I'll believe. That it's a problem or that I'm working on that it? That it's your nature. Oh. Well, Mr. Perlman, this has been a delight having you on, on the program. It was your pleasure. I have one more it, question yes, for you. Okay? Yes. Looking back on your 70 years, mm -hmm. do you have any regrets? Well, the regrets is that I did this, this program, you know, but that's very recent. It's a uh -huh, recent regret. Uh -huh.